Welcome back to Jersey Matters. I'm Larry Menti. The Varsity Blues college admission scandal has put a spotlight on how difficult it is to get into the college of your choice. But our Vanessa Tyler introduces you now to a young man who has his pick of colleges and Vanessa, he did it the right way. Larry, that's right. You know this is the time seniors are on pins and needles. Did they get into the college of their choice? We recently learned some are illegally buying their way in, but what if you don't have the money? Meet one young man who has something in him money can't buy. It just shows that people who don't have the same privileges or connections have to work 10 times harder than those who do to achieve the same goal. For 17-year-old Dylan Chittick, overachieving paid off because this senior at Jersey City Snyder High School got into all of the colleges where he applied, all 18 of them. I'm really grateful that I've been accepted to all these colleges because I didn't think I was going to get in. His doubt due to his obstacles. During his junior year, he, his mom, and two younger brothers couldn't afford their apartment when his mother lost her job. We didn't know where we were going to go. So we became homeless and then we lived in a shelter called the, the family Yosef. lived in a shelter for four months and his grades suffered. But thanks to the support of his family and his school, that fighting tiger spirit pushed him to hold on. For me, it's just uh, absolutely amazing to see Dylan get this light. Given all the recent scandals around colleges and acceptances, to have a story, really an American story, of a student working hard, showing perseverance and grit, and being able to excel, even with all of the challenges of homelessness and being displaced. His great accomplishment comes at a time the nation is focused on college admissions, where rich and famous parents like stars Felicity Hoffman and Lori Laughlin are accused of buying their children a spot at prestigious universities. His principal says Dylan has become somewhat of a rock star at his school and a role model. What better motivation to see their peers, someone who lives in their neighborhood, uh, experiences some of the same struggles that they do, to be able to excel and get recognition for excelling, not for something bad, for something great. So with the world at his fingertips, where is Dylan going in the fall? His dream school, the College of New Jersey, on a full scholarship. At Snyder High School in Jersey City, I'm Vanessa Tyler for Jersey Matters.